Oh. Richard, Richard, I just hope. Thank you. You've got to wait a minute. <laughs> All right. I just hope that someday there's a great big fire and just my films are destroyed. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> the last time you and I got together on television, I cried. Now, I don't do that very often. I, I was very excited about the moment because I'd been trying to talk you into appearing in public for eons, and you did it. Does this mean you're going to be back with us recording again? I'm going to be recording, yes, I am, Dick. Uh -huh. I'm not going to travel on the road a lot, though. That's What's wrong with that? Wait a minute, let me ask you about that song. Is that autobiographical? Is there anything in yeah, that song? Yeah, I wasn't recording. I wasn't doing anything very much except watching a videotape cassette of the 1978 show we did on <laughs> Wednesday Night Live. And I went up to visit George, my manager, one day, and there were two 19-year-old fellows there who um, said they'd written a song for me. And it reminded me of Neil Sedak and Howie Greenfield when they were both 19 or 20 and came to see me all around the same time, you know. And I listened to the lyrics of the song and I said, how could two 19-year-old people be so perceptive and know just what I wanted to say? So, you know, yeah. forgive me, there are people in this audience who are too young to know what happened to all of us back in the stone age of all of this beginning. This lady sold over 50 million records. She was the world's most popular female vocalist, sang in every language. She, uh, she is, to, so you can relate to it, bigger than Linda Ronstadt by infinitely so. And then she stopped, and you never did it again. I became Why would you do I that? hit out. I just hit out. I don't know. I, now I have a six-year-old child, and I don't want him to be uh, a part of the business. I just want him to be shielded from it, you know? I love the business, but I just want him to be just an everyday kid. We're glad you're back and chose this place to come back. Thank you. Will you sing another one? I sure will. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Connie Francis.